local ministry is bringing a light to a community facing many challenges right now. The Light of the Village celebrated Easter over the weekend for folks in Alabama Village. The celebration served as a way for residents to step away from violence and recent potential water cutoff worries. NBC 15's Emily Pounds has our story this morning. The race, I play football, soccer ball, basketball. Laughter filled the air at Light of the Village Sunday. <laughs> Providing a welcomed break from the stresses and difficulties that many in the community are facing on a daily basis. In spite of everything, I mean, things still continue to grow. Faith, love, and hope endure through all. And so we knew this would be an awesome time to have just a great celebration. John Eads is the founder of Light of the Village. He says with some of the community potentially losing access to basic necessities like running water, it was time to bring everyone together. The one thing we've learned after being out here for 20 years is perseverance. I mean, you roll with the turbulence. On top of the water uncertainties, gun violence has become a leading problem in the area. As far as our memorial wall, we've lost six in the last 12 months. It's one of those sad things that we endure and that we walk with the community through. In spite of all that darkness, the light does shine. Despite these setbacks, the Easter block party provided a chance for families and children to enjoy an afternoon filled with Easter egg hunts, warm food, and festive activities. Happy Easter! Happy Easter! The ministry is currently seeking help with meals and food distribution, so if you'd like to learn more to help, we have information on our website, mynbc15.com.